So, you've thought up a great business idea, and it's now time to give it a name. It's an important step because nowadays your business name is a big part of your brand and can go a long way into telling your customers who you are. A business name that is on brand, memorable, unique, rolls off the tongue and tells people what you do is what you want to aim for. If you're feeling stuck and needing a bit of inspo to get those creative juices flowing, try this. List out every single word you'd associate with your business. All of them. Now see if you can join any of these together, say like YouTube did. Or maybe there's a short, sharp phrase that could be a good fit, like trade me. You could keep things simple and use your own name, e.g. S. Smith Plumbing, or an invented one like Hagen Das. Or you could even make up your own word, like Google did. And once you've found a few potentials that could fit the bill, it's worthwhile to test the names out on friends and or family, ideally, members of your target market. Perform an A-B test to determine which of the two, three or four potentials they like best. And once you've got your top pick, you want to check if it's available to use and hasn't already been claimed by another New Zealand business. Luckily, MBIE make this super easy for all of us. Their online tool OneCheck lets you check if a business name, trademark, web domain or social media handle is usable. Simply head to the website and insert the name into the box and within seconds you'll know whether it's in use or something similar is, how original it is, which web domains if any are free to use and which social media platforms have a free handle with that title. Click through to each of these categories and you'll be presented with more in-depth information, allowing you to judge whether you'll be at risk of any legal action if you use your chosen business name. If the name is being used by a business in the same or related industry, it's a real risk that you could be. But if you're in the clear, click through further and one check links you through to the sites where you can reserve your business name, register your domain name, your trademark or something, and claim that social media username you're needing. Ugh, jeepers, how easy was that?